hi loves welcome back again to my youtube channel and i young as always welcome back to my world guys of course today is our inspiration month please if you're clicking for the very first time don't forget to subscribe like share and also comment and to my returning subscribers thank you so much god bless you for always coming back to watch my videos i really really appreciate it and uh, today i have a walk some people slack in prayer some people won't stop praying completely some people you don't even mind staying weeks days in sober weeping trying to calm themselves down trying to feel like okay this one is not working for me what next should i do i'm not assistant jesus yes please i'm not assistant jesus but what i think that may be hindering your prayers could be one it's not your time it's not your time you cannot fast track the time that god have written about you that is one thing i keep on making people to understand see when is your time when god says is your time no jupiter on this planet earth will stop it everything will definitely fall in places why i'm telling you about this because i have experienced it in some cases just like when i wrote jam i never knew that i would ever go to school because after my secondary school when i was 15 years old i came out from secondary school when i was 15 years old i started writing jam i wrote the fourth jam second jam third jam every year i'm writing jam every year i'm writing almost three good times after that third one that i wrote i said okay this is no longer working let me just go and find my find my destiny where it is like i have already made up my mind to go and start doing something although deep down my heart i knew that i wanted to go to school but it's not coming sometimes they will seize my results sometimes the results will come out maybe if i get to something they will tell me nothing cut off mark is this is 260 270 and i will now be having 230 220 so many things were happening i was like okay maybe my calling is not for school that was what I thought. But I never knew that God had some good plans for me. What am I trying to say? You cannot fast track what God has ordained. If God says that you are going to get married 2023 this year, nothing on earth will stop it. When God says that this is what is going to happen for your family, as long as you are praying, I'm not saying if you are not praying, because if you are not praying, Satan can literally rip you off your blessings. If you are not praying, you are not doing uh the things i need to do as a christian to pray for your future it will be cut off but when you know that you are praying you're on the right track you are doing what god says that you should do as a christian there is no jupiter that will rip you off your blessings or stop your destiny and you cannot fast track your destiny that's one thing christian doesn't know i know that grace sometimes can literally draw some things closer but not immediately that time that you need it. It doesn't happen. So what I'm trying to tell you that, calm down. It may not be the right time for that blessing or for that prayer to be answered. God always comes through for his people. When it's a matter of life and death, God will always show up at 11th hour. But when God says that that will not kill you, he will gradually take off that burden off your shoulder. Before you know it, you'll be like, uh -uh, I'm no longer seeing this thing. What happened? That's how God works. And the second thing on my list is, maybe you are not saying the right prayer. Mm -hmm. You are not saying the right You know that some people, when they want to pray, they'll start complaining. They will complain, oh God, you gave Mr. Eka. You did not give me blah 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 <laughs> it's not good please don't do that if you're in that category stop it and second thing on this um um you're not praying right is whenever you want to pray condemn yourself just condemn yourself in the presence of god don't try to come and feel righteous god i have sowed the seed i have done this i have done charity work i know that there is always a blessing attached to whatever that you do in this life that is good but when it comes to how God works, I don't even know. But the things that we can literally see and reveal to us by the Holy Ghost, He can ask well, say, this is what it is, right? If you are with the Holy Spirit, if you communicate with the Holy Spirit, you will actually understand where I'm heading to. If you want to pray, pray the right prayer and always pray and ask God to forgive you. Ask for mercy. 
If you pray all this prayer in this life without asking for mercy, that prayer is not complete. Always come to God and ask for mercy. God, I know that I have sinned against you. I don't even deserve these blessings. This is what I want. This is what I need. God, please, it's only you that can do it for me. Have mercy on me. At every given time, Jesus Christ wants to do a miracle. He will hear, and Jesus move with mercy and compassion. So say the right prayer. Stop complaining. Stop comparing your problem with another people. Stand on the right track. Even if you don't know what to say, just tell God, God have mercy upon me. Because if you have mercy upon me, my life is going to turn out to be good. I don't want this video to be too long. I just want it to be very fast so that one or two people can grab value from this video. And the last button on my list today is faith. Faith. We oftentimes hear about faith. We go to church, our pastor preach about faith. We go to fellowship, Bible study. We keep on hearing this faith, faith, faith. Let me tell you one thing. If you don't believe in what you pray for, it can never be done. I know that grace of God can literally favor us. But as a Christian, there is an obligation that you have to fulfill, which is doing the right thing and having faith in God. You have to as a Christian. So what am I trying to tell you? Please, I'm encouraging you anytime you pray believe don't doubt your prayer don't try to say i don't know if this prayer will work i don't know i prayed two years ago nothing happened prayed last year nothing happened remember it is written that life and death lies in our tongue so whatever you prophesy or say that this may be unknowingly to you you said i don't know if this prayer will work satan will just grab it that is why whenever you pray don't allow challenges difficulties to destroy what you have prayed for. Don't doubt it. Just believe and have faith in God. If God can carry you all through answers, and you are seeing this video today, there is a purpose why you are still alive. Just believe that you are going to achieve that purpose. Just have faith in God. Never lose God in Christ. He is the author and the finisher of our, of our faith. He is the same yesterday, today and forever. I know we are not worthy of his blessings, but through his wondrous mercy and compassion, all our prayers will be answered. Amen. So guys, I'm going to stop here today. I will see you guys on my next video. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share and also comment. I love you guys, but just know that Jesus Christ in heaven loves you the most. I'm still your babe, Ada Young. Bye.